What's up everyone, I'm Jessica. Today I'm opening four different Bando goodie bags and they're all different. Well, they're all supposed to be different. Each goodie bag has a different theme. One is travel, one is outdoor, one is desk, and one is going out. So I'm excited to see what I get in each goodie bag. Each of these goodie bags is valued at about $100. I paid $25 for each of these goodie bags. And this is the first time Bandel has had different themes for their goodie bags. Usually they only have like one type of goodie bag and you buy it and you see what you get. But this time it was different themes so I'm really really excited and curious as to what is inside each of these goodie bags. They all came packaged like this. No labels or anything, just wrapped up. Hopefully I can differentiate which theme goes with each of these. I don't know if there's like a label on the inside or what, but I know one of these for sure is the travel bag and I think it's this one. So there's no bag on the inside, it's just in this packaging. So this is the first thing I pulled out of this goodie bag. So these are just like little travel bags. Weekends are forever, it says it on both sides. Both sides of this one are the floral pattern and that's what the inside looks like. These are cool travel bags. You can use them for pretty much anything you wanna use them for. So next I pulled out this. This is cool, it's like iridescent and that's I don't know, it just looks so cool to me. But on the inside it has stuff in, they're like little bottles that you can fill up with product. Then we have one of these, one of these types of bottles. And then this one has like a cap that goes like that. They don't squeeze or anything and they feel like plastic. So four bottles, two pump caps, spray cap, press top cap, flip top cap, a mini spatula, two pots, and a funnel. These are labels right here so that you can know what exactly is in each bottle if you want to label it. But here's a little spatula, I don't know if you can see that. And then here's the funnel. And then here are the two pots. I think that was worth it. That was cool. You never know when you're gonna need that stuff. When I've gone on trips, I have like stuff that's travel size and stuff, but sometimes you can't find that stuff and you have to go shopping for stuff. So this is kind of convenient. And I love the iridescence. That's my favorite part of this bag. Next I pulled out this. It's one of those luggage tags. It's really cool, really big. I like that it's a watermelon. I don't know, I've never seen a watermelon luggage tag. So I think that's unique and cool. Next I have this. This is a passport holder and what's cool about this is that it has little slots for cards. I've never had a passport holder, so this is really cool to me. So the next thing I pulled out is this USB charging cable. I think the colors are fun, kind of like tie-dye. I like it, it's different. I've gotten a USB cable in the past, in one of my past goodie bags that I've gotten, and I liked it so much. And it wasn't like this color, so. I think it's cool that they have different colors to choose from. The next thing I pulled out is this. It's a necklace that says confidence and it has an adjustable chain which is 16 inches. Nice. And that was all that came in the travel goodie bag. I put up the prices just so you could see how much everything costs and see if it actually added up to $100, about or around $100. I hope that was helpful in knowing if you do want to get a goodie bag in the future. So we're gonna move on to the next goodie bag. And I'm gonna keep putting the prices up just so you can see. New goodie bag, let's go. So I kind of just like looked through just to make sure since these aren't labeled, but I believe this is the desk goodie bag. They have included another one of these necklaces and this one says strength. I like how each of these are packaged in a different color. It's kind of cool and fun. And same thing, 16 inch adjustable chain. Oh, these are cool. Okay, so next I got these pens. What's cool about these pens is that the little sparkles on the inside of the pens move. Like if you flip it upside down, it's gonna move. Like, let me watch. I hope that was visible because the first time I did it, it was blurry. <laughs> anyway, these are cute. And I like the little dots and smiley faces, the sparkles on the inside. It just makes it fun to write. Next I pulled out these. 
these. These are some cool mechanical pencils. They look really fun. I think somebody would have a lot of fun writing with these just because they look fun. Okay, so next I pulled out this. It says Ultimate Planner Pack. I'll open it up so we can see what's on the inside. It says there's a bunch of fun stickers. Be nice, work hard, have fun. Paper tape, multicolored pencil, dot stickers, pencil sharpener, enamel pen clip, and number one optimist bookmark. I like this little slot. That's cool. Like you can put paper in there if you want, like how they did. Okay, so this is the enamel pen clip. You just stick your pen right through here and it'll hold it. That's so cool. I've never seen one of these. This is the multicolored pencil. That's fun. I haven't seen a pencil that's multicolored in a long time, like since I was a little kid. So I think this is really fun. And then this is the paper tape. And then here are all the stickers all in one little packaging. I think these stickers on this side are in the new planners. So that's really cool that they included some in this goodie bag. Here's the bookmark. Got a little bent, but it'll straighten out in a book. And then here's the pencil sharpener. That was a cool little pencil pouch. Had some cool stuff in there. I think a kid would be pumped to get a whole pencil pouch that's like packed with cool stuff, especially like this out of the pencil pouch. That was really cool. Next, I got this notebook set and I'm gonna open it just so we can see each design better. I love notebooks, I use them all the time. So it's always cool to get new notebooks. Here's the first one. Here's what the notebook paper looks like. And then in the middle it has this. And here's this one. And it has the same thing on the inside. And then here's the last one. So like I said, notebooks are always useful. So these are pretty cool to have. So this is the last thing I pulled out from the desk goodie bag. This is really heavy. It's a ceramic mug, so you can get a gist of what it's made out of. This is cool. It's really pink. So now we're on to the next goodie bag. So it's either gonna be outdoor or going out. I think this is the going out bag. First item I pulled out is this, and I'm gonna go ahead and take it out of the box because it is a double-sided compact, and I just wanna check it out. It's really heavy. Oh my gosh, this is cool. I like this. This is actually a really nice compact and it's a double-sided mirror on the inside. One side is normal and then the other side enlarges things. So I think this is awesome and I think it's a really good quality product. I'm pumped that I got it. I think this is really cool. It's probably one of my favorite things that I've gotten so far. Next I got this water bottle. This is cool, like I literally was just holding this and I kind of like heard something and I was like, what is that? And it's the sparkles, they actually move on the inside. So if you like shake it up and stuff, that's cool. I like the shiny aspect to it. This yellow color, it just brightens up the bottle a lot. I like it. I got this one step at a time keychain. Super colorful, looks fun, it's inspirational. I got another one of these necklaces. This one says gratitude. Next, I got this Get It Together card case. It's a cool, fun, colorful design. It could be useful. The last item I pulled out of this bag is this. And it's a clutch. And on the inside, it actually has another pocket. It's pretty big, and the extra pocket is big, so. So we're finally on to the last goodie bag and I think this one is the outdoor one since I've opened up all the rest. Okay, here's the first item I pulled out. It's a beach ball and I think that's what it's supposed to look like. That's cool for going out. It's fun. Next I got these sunglasses. 
I think these are really fun looking. I think a kid might enjoy these. I don't know if I would wear them personally. These are cool and yeah, people wear sunglasses when they go out. So I can see how they put sunglasses in the outdoor one. Next, I pulled out this. And this is actually a glasses case. And on the inside, it came with the little wipey that comes with glasses so that you can clean them. And then here's what it looks like on the inside. And then here's this. It's still in the plastic just because I don't want to touch it. I like how it's different colors on both sides. I don't know how well this would protect glasses since I do wear glasses. So I know how like you have to protect them, but I guess if they're like the sunglasses I just got, then I guess that would be fine to put them in. But like as somebody who wears glasses, I know how important it is to protect your glasses. And I just don't feel like your glasses would be protected in this but it's cute and it's fun. Since I don't think it would like protect glasses, I just think that you can use it for other things. This is the last necklace that I got and it's joy. Next I got this tumbler and the sparkles move on this as well. Like if you shake it, I think this is cool. They give a lot of tumblers in their goodie bags. So <laughs> if you need one of those, you're probably gonna get one in one of their goodie bags. <laughs> what I like about it is that this is a twist cap. I think that's a great feature. Next, I got this lunch bag. So here's what it looks like on the inside. And it has like this middle divider section. Oh, and you can take it off if you need the space. This is like a little pocket for whatever you're gonna put in there. And then another little pocket. I like that it has insulation. That's cool. I like that it's tie-dye on the outside. I think it's a cool lunchbox. It's nice and big. It's a good size. Out of all four of those goodie bags, the best one to me was the desk, then the travel, then the going out, and then the outdoor one. I think they were all worth it. They had some really big items in each bag, so that's always exciting. I don't know, like, as a person who gets goodie bags or, like, does unboxings and stuff, I think the bigger items are the most exciting items. But that's just me. I mean, I did like some of the smaller items as well because some of them were actually really cool and different and unique. I just think these goodie bags were all cool in their own ways. But personally, I like the desk one the best. I just wanted to add that this is part of their warehouse sale. So you kind of just have to sign up for the emails or be aware of what's going on in their website to kind of find out what they're going to have on sale. and. I found out through email. That's how I learned about the warehouse sale and how they had the goodie bags. Let me know which item you liked the best or which goodie bag you liked the best. If you like this video, make sure to give it a like. And if you're new, make sure to subscribe and click the notification bell. I would love to have you here on my channel. And I will see you next time.